the ability to rotate the squad and give everybody an opportunity um, is key, really, and that the competitive nature of the squad um, makes your role as a coach much easier because they're all fighting for places and you know they want to be they want to be there um, playing wearing wearing the blue jersey. So um, no, it's good to have so many healthy um, players available um, and the nature of that competition just. It just grows then, uh, gathers momentum, um, and everybody's you know competing for a place. And that's one of the things that um, you know Leinster are renowned for. They're, they're integrating these players in training um, at an earlier age, and that's why the academy system is so fruitful. Um, they're exposed uh, in training sessions, playing against, training against uh, these players, and they, they've got to stand up to the mark. And um, when they come through the training and they, they've earned their right to, to put on the jersey, then they've just got to deliver. Um, but it's great to see um, you know, young players making their first appearances or what have you. you know, there's a couple of props as well. Um, you know, learning their trade and you know, playing in Thorman Park and Full House. It's a, you, you can't re recreate that, um, that cauldron as you uh, described it. So to have them perform, um, you know, and we weren't perfect by, by any stretch. Um, we gave them far too many opportunities, definitely in the last five minutes of that game, to get uh, back into the game. So, you know, to having learned those lessons and come away with a win, um, it was great. What I know of Connacht is, you know, they're a team that never give up, and uh, any team that never gives up, they're going to be they're going to be a handful. Um, we've already been reminded of the the fixture this time last year, where we were lucky to get away with a win uh, with a late um, Andrew Porter try. So, you know. They're going to come here uh, with nothing to lose, really, and everything to gain. And uh, that makes them a very dangerous uh, team. So we're going to have to be at our best again. And, um, you know, it's going to be it's an interpro at the end of the day. And uh, a lot of it will come down to, you know, desire and the will to win. Um, look at the game against Manchester on Saturday. You know, there wasn't uh, there was quite a few errors in the, from both sides, really. But... Um, you know, that determination, that um, that doggedness of just digging in and, and not willing to relent was that was evident really.